today and many days before we've been studying how to use our brains and think so we can figure out things when we're reading. This is our first reading and thinking exercise. It's an exercise for developing critical thinking skills. All right. Peggy was out shopping. She bought some bread, butter, and meat. Then she went home by bus. What store was she in? The flower shop, the music shop, the supermarket. Kaden, why did you think that? or a music shop. What were the items? Who remembers the items that she purchased? Who remembers the items? Isabella. Bread, milk. Nope. Wait. She got bread. Who else can get anything oh. else? Kiana. Butter. Yes, oh. one more thing, Shay. Meat. Meat, all right. Oh, okay, here's our last question. Do you think she had a shopping cart? Do you think she had a shopping cart? Skyla. No. Hmm. Why would you think no? Does she just hold these items in her arms? Well, because they're stuff that they're helping people to use usually use a shopping cart. Only you could. You could hold it. You could hold it because there's only three things. I like that thinking. What do most people do? What do most people do? Oh. Laura Lynn? Get a shopping cart. I would. Why would you? Because sometimes we buy lots of foods. Yeah, we, we, we buy lots of foods. We don't want to carry it around. Here's our last one. Let's see who can use their brain and think of think, think, think. It is winter. He has just come home from school and it is getting dark. What meal is he going to eat? Breakfast, lunch, or supper? Breakfast, lunch, or supper? Skylar. Supper. Why would you think supper? Because it's dark and you usually you eat supper at the end of the day. I agree. Here's our last question. Is he a child? Or is he grown up? Is he a child? Demi, why would you think that? Ah, smart, smart students.